Look out, that ball's OB, and that'll be a one-shot penalty. So playing the third shot right now after having gone OB. Frank couldn't ask for anything more. Uh, just the lie there, too. It is sitting up like it's teed up. So, Frank, on this approach shot, really all you can do is, is try to salvage a bogey. Yeah, just uh, too many mistakes in the compiling. So if you can get out here with a bogey, in some respects, that's a, a result. And he's made the green. Settles in over the putt. How does that not go in? Amazing. Stroke looked good. Uh, line looked good. Just did not take that final break. So with that, the score is now at even par. Now to the par for 11th, just a shade under 440 yards. Where are the difficulties here, Frank? The water down the left, but the hole keeps going that way, almost in a semi-horseshoe fashion. Two bunkers down the right, they always catch the straight tee shot, but um, once again, you, you don't have to hit driver here. You've got to get that ball in play. Frank, he is one of the longest hitters in the game, but at some point, you have to hit a fairway. Yeah, he's uh, certainly not the straightest. I think that was the bit you're gonna put in the middle. Frank, out of the rough, best to swing a little bit easier or get after it with all you have? Well, a little bit in between. Obviously, it's going to require a little bit of strength to make sure that club keeps going through, but it's still the planning of the shot. Once again, check short. Do, is there anything I have to carry? And even remember, there's always the option of just simply pitching the ball down the fairway and taking your medicine. 14 feet to the hole. You can see why this player has been compared to a young Rory McIlroy, featured golfer making birdie and now sitting comfortably inside that cut line. Nicely played shot, about 310 yards down the fairway. Frank, the tournament scoring record was set by Buddy Allen. That was way back in 1973. A whopping 23 under. That's that's like a video game score. Yeah, they made sure that would never happen again. They lengthened the golf course. They, they, they firmed up the greens. They sped them up. They did everything to make sure that nobody, including you, ever shoots 23 under here again. Frank, really good chance from this position to make a birdie. Yeah, really the only thing he's looking at right now is the flag. Uh, this is a green light special. And it makes the green in regulation. Chance for back to back. Starting to move on this leaderboard now, Frank. It's got a nice look to it. Like a who's who. At the par four, 13th now. And Frank, what's the key here? Really avoid those three bunkers, Rich. You don't want a fairway bunker shot over water for your second shot. Yeah. 
Headed for the bunker? Not what he wanted, but he's headed to the beach. Well, we've seen this before today, in the bunker. I'm thinking this is about 110 yards, Frank. Here to be a decent strike. Just hitting a little left. He's knocked it on the green, but not in a great position. This is a difficult chance coming up here. Long birdie try. This is a really long putt. Difficult birdie opportunity. Pretty good stroke right there. Just hit it through the break. Well, it's that sort of distance. If it goes in, it's a bonus. These putts keep the round together. With authority, count it as a par and two under. Another challenging par three here at Bay Hill. It's the 14th, 216 yards, Frank. It plays uphill, prevailing breeze too into your face, so normally much longer than its yardage. And this one starting down the right does not look like it's gonna draw back towards the flag but it will catch the green. Birdie try, up next. Birdie chance here. Very long putt, though. Got to be a little careful if it gets away on him. Consider the length of that pot. That's a good pot. And getting ready for the pot. Drops for a pot. Frank, the 15th, kind of a fun golf hole, if you can curve your ball. I mean, that's a huge dogleg to the right, isn't it? Yeah, it's much easier if you're a right-hander if you cut it down here. If you don't cut it, then make sure you don't run out down that left side. Oh. Whoop, this has taken off on a weird line. And it's going to be in the rough, it looks like. We moved that one out there, but he is not going to like the lie. Uh, that moved down in the rough. And this attempt will be from about 130 yards. Playing this par four, still not on the green after that second shot. But still not done. Um, a good third shot, maybe get away here with par. Okay, good shot on the dance floor. Holding steady now at two under par. The Bay Hill Club and Lodge features a really exciting finishing stretch. 16 is a reachable par five. You'll see eagles and birdies there coming home. 17, a very difficult par three over the water. 
The bunker is there, takes an excellent shot. And that 18 is all you want. We know that with the water in front, that second shot which comes over the lake, and that's a hold your breath moment. It is a great finishing three hole stretch at Bay Hill. Outstanding tee shot. Yeah, ball sitting up. You don't have to worry about the wind or anything there. You just take a full blooded cut at the second shot from here. Not a huge miss, Frank, but did lose this just a little to the right. Yeah, it looks like it's going to catch a piece of the green, though. Well, that was a big, bold strike, and now a chance for a big, bold move. Putt for Eagle coming up. And the computer dials this one up at 26 feet. You couldn't ask for much more than that, except to make it. Headed in the right direction with that birdie. It just sneaks into the top ten. It's a good move this week. Frank, deep into a round. Par 3, 17th. Water. Bunkers. Long shot. What are you thinking as you're stepping on this tee? You just take three and move to 18. Look out, this could be wet, Frank. It's heading towards the hazard. Into the thick stuff, that's a difficult lie. Just trying to make clean contact from the rough. Frank landed it on the green. It was never gonna stop. No, no chance. Solid play, heart of the green. Now at minus two for the day. Frank, this is a stout finishing hole, the 18th, isn't it? Yeah, it finishes that great run of 16, 17, and 18, and so many times. We've seen disaster and triumph just on those final three holes. Frank, it's a hard game to play from the high grass. But, and that's where he's been more often than not today. Frank, just into that first cut. Yeah, it's sitting up. Um, really, th this, isn't, this isn't too bad a situation. Safely on deck. Safely aboard. Boy, this could be a tough one right here, Frank. It's a very long putt, Rich. Obviously, it's difficult, uh, but he still has a shot to sink this one for birdie. How does that not go in? Amazing. Stroke looked good. Uh, line looked good. Just did not take that final break. Just a couple of feet. That's a round of 70 on the deck. Second round coverage coming your way tomorrow. For our entire crew, I'm Rich Lerner alongside Frank Navalo. So long for now.